So yesterday, a local Instagram seller, whose name is Valley underscore Kicks on Instagram, I've done business with him a few times, but he made me, he made me this one thousand dollar mystery box. So let's just get right into it and see what we got. Here's the first box, a size three and a half youth dunk low, and it's some UNLV dunks, and these are brand new as well. So pretty good shoe here. Dunks usually an easy move, especially since it's brand new. So that's the first shoe, some three and a half youth UNLV dunks. For these dunks on StockX, you can see here, goes for about 128. The last sell was 127, so I'll put in market price 128 for these. They're dunks, so I feel like I could get, I could get at least that amount. So 128 for these dunks. <clears throat> Let's go on to the next shoe. I'm going to go with this woman's Jordan box. And this is a size eight and a half women's, so seven in men's. Oh, I, I haven't seen these before, and they're pretty nice as well. It's going to be a pair of mids. Never seen this colorway before. And these are also brand new as well. So this is the second shoe, some mids. Brand new, a size seven in men's eight and a half in women's so these mids are called jordan one mid aqua blue tint and you can see here eight and a half women's lowest has 144 highest bids 129 last sell 146 and these came out yeah they did come out recently on june 7th so a couple months ago for some reason i've never seen these but for these i'm going to put in the i'm going to put in like 145 based off the recent sale. So now I'm at 273 so far with the two shoes. It looks like there's a few more mystery, I mean, a few more shoe boxes left, so. Pretty good sign there, but let's go with this Jordan box. Size eight Jordan one, I mean, you can kind of see the shoe right here. And it's, I think these are the crimson tint, but I might be wrong. I've had a grade school pair of these, but I haven't had a men's size. So this is the third shoe, some Jordan 1 mids, crimson tint. So for these in a size 8, you see the market price right here, but the last sale was 157 So let's see the, re the more recent sales. See, there's some 135s, but there's also some 150, 160, 140. Kind of hard to mark this, so I'll just put Lois Ask on this, so one, 145 on these. So I'm at 418 so far with three shoes. So let's go on to the next. Let's go with this box. Size eight and a half, another mid. And it's the same shoe. So this one's a size eight, this one's a size eight and a half, so. I already have market price up on here so let's look at it and an eight and a half it's for a little lower last sale was 152 as well i'll put in market i'll put in like 140 for these it's 140 there so i'm at 558 with these three shoes and then the fourth shoe here Let me take it out real quick so far three pair of mids and then the Small size UNLV dunks. You see here. So here's what I've gotten so far. Let's go on to the next shoe. I'm gonna go with this. Looks like only three shoe boxes left. <clears throat> this is a Jordan 1 Low. And I don't know what these are. These might. I don't know for sure, but these might be the University of Blue that just came out. Kind of forgot how it looked, but this is the fifth shoe here, the Jordan 1 Low, size 11, and these are also brand new. So, so far, all brand new shoes at least, so that's good. But this is a good colorway. Hopefully, they go for a good amount, but I'm going to check it right now. So, this was the UNC Jordan 1 Lows that I said that just recently came out. And their marketing is around like 140-ish. The last sell was 139, so I'm gonna put in 140 for these. These dropped, um, I would say like a week ago, a little over a week ago, so 
I'm putting 140 on for these. Oh, I messed up. I put I put 14 instead of 140, so I'll take off the one the 14. I had 140, so I'm at 698 with five shoes and two shoes left. So the last two shoes have to be worth at least 302 bucks just to get my money back. So hopefully these are good. Go with this. And it looks like it's gonna be the Jordan 6 Electric Greens, and they are. I recently gotten rid of my last pair of these, so just got another pair back. But these are also brand new. It's a size, it's a size 11 and a half. So 11 and a half might be a good, it might be worth a lot more than the other pairs, because that's how usually 11 and a half and 12 and a half are. But I'm gonna check it right now. But this is the sixth shoe, some Jordan 6 Electric Greens. So for these sixes, going for around 240, the last sell was 240 as well. So I'm gonna put in 240 for these. So I'm at $938 with all six of these shoes, all of them brand new. With one shoe to go, the last shoe has to be worth at least $62 just to get my money back. So looks like whatever it is, I'll at least be able to make some profit. But here's the last shoe. Looks like a Jordan 12 or Jordan 11 box. And it is a size 10 and a half. Oh, it's a Jordan 12 twist. I had recently gotten rid of my last pair of these too, so just got these back. But these are these are also brand new. So this good this is the last shoe, a size 10 and a half Jordan 12 twist. I think these are going for like around 230 to 240 right now. So with that price, I'd be able to make at least 100 150 dollar profit, but I'm gonna check market on it right now. For a size 10 and a half, <clears throat> the last sell was 225 and you can see the market price is right there. So I'm gonna put in 225 for these. So after that, that all adds up to $1,163. With the seven shoes, that's at least $163 profit. So even though you could consider a lot of these bricks, like there's some mids in here, and some people don't really like mids. And these two that came out are, um, people consider them bricks, but either way, they're all brand new. Should be pretty easy to move since they are new. And the profit is definitely there. So I think this is a pretty good box. Shout out to Valley Kicks for bringing this for me. But here's his Instagram. I'll have his, his information in my description as well in case you guys wanna check him out. But this is his $1,000 mystery box for me. Seven dead stock shoes. If I had to rate this box, I would say somewhere between like a seven or eight out of 10. So like a seven and a half out of 10. There's some definitely, there's some bricks in here that might be hard to move like the mids, but the profit is there, they're brand new. So it should be easier than if it was used. So I think it's a pretty good box. Shout out to him once again, but let me know what you guys think of the box. Leave it down in the comments below. If you want to buy any of these, just DM me on my Instagram at jcresales559. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to this channel like this video i have a what was it i think it's a 540 forty dollar mystery box from two kick shoes coming in that i have posted soon so stay tuned for that but thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys next time